Hello and welcome back. My name is Loopy and today I will be showing you guys how to make this Octonaut base that I featured in my last video. Let's get into the video. For this build we will need black concrete, grey concrete, sea lanterns, orange concrete, glass, terracotta and light blue concrete. So to start we want to go one, two, three, four, five, six with black concrete and one, two, three, four, five, six and then one, two, three, four, five, six and one, two, three, four, five, six and then go up eight layers so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Then join all this together very quickly. So I'll cut back to that because that might take a while. Okay, I'm back. And also, by the way, it's ten blocks up rather than eight. I think I said eight. Alright, now what we're going to do is we're going to go in the middle two blocks like this. We're going to make a line of sea lanterns going up like this all the way to the top. Like that, I mean like that. And then either side of it we want grey concrete like this very quickly. Uh like that and this will be symmetrical all around and then one block up we're going to go out two and then down one like that and the same one two down one and out one we're going to repeat this on all of the four sides so I'll cut back again when I have done that alright now that those are all in place we're going to grab our orange concrete and go out one like this and go one two three four five one two three four five six there we go and then like this minus this one and one two three four five six and again like this and one two blah, blah, blah. like that and again this is the same all around i mean like that sorry and there we go and then we're going to do that again going out one like this and for this bit we're just going to go like that and like that and again all around like that there we go this is nearly done there we go and that one that one join these up and mine that block and this block and this block then we're gonna go again one two and there we go and this is just one last layer and then we'll be going up and making the main bit of it this bit's a bit tedious but we'll get there in the end like this and this and this like there we go and there and there 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 and mine these two blocks and we're nearly there so if we just keep on going there Mind this block, mind this block, there, mind this block, and we are done. Now what we want to do is go up one, two, three, four, five, five, and do that along all of the sides, so basically like fill it all in, and I'll cut back to you once I've filled all of that in. 
All right, now it is starting to look a bit more like the finished project, as now we have the body in. So now we're going to go one, two, and mine this block, this block, this block, this block, and the same on the other side. One, two, three, four. Then go inside, fill it all with glass, like so. Bam, 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 bam. And then go like an L. Like this. And put a sea lantern in and a sea lantern in. Then we'll go out and have a look what that looks like. Looking pretty good. Okay, now what we're going to do is line the top with black concrete like this. Bam, bam. And nearly done. At least this bit's a lot quicker than filling in with the orange concrete. That's something. And then we're going to put glass on top of this black concrete like this. And then our next stage will be to do the diagonal effect like we did with the orange concrete. But we only need to do it once and going inwards this time. So like this rather than outwards. And like that. Smash. And there we go. There we go. The sound of glass breaking in this game is so good. It's like the two best sounds in this game is glass breaking and slime blocks breaking. In my opinion, anyway. And we'll just finish doing that. There we go. Now, what we want to do is get orange concrete and do that like this. And this will give it more of a circular effect, doing all this diagonal stuff. Um, so it looks more round, like it should do, rather than square. Which, I do admit, is a lot hard, like, a, very hard with um, blocks, isn't it? So that's why we're having to use the diagonal effect. And there we go nearly done last block there we go okay now let's have a look at that that is looking pretty good now all we have to do is the arms for the arms and the pods all we will need is black concrete gray concrete and glass so oh my screen shook a bit there so we'll go out one two like that and then like this, like this, and I mean, like that, sorry, and then like this. There we go, and one more, and another one, and then, sorry, from here, we'll want to go one, two, one, two, one, two. One, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, and finally, one, two, three. Then, what we're going to want to do is do the diagonal effect again, this time going outwards. This is once again to make a circular effect with square blocks. So, interesting. Um,. Our next block will need to be glass for the windows and we'll be once again doing the square, I mean the circular effect, yay. Okay, so we're going to go one, two, just line this all with glass like so and then go in with the glass like this why is my screen shaking so much uh, like that and there we go then we'll want to go like 
this like that now all of these pods are exactly the same so i won't need to do each one individually all right now that is practically the base finished all we need to do now is grab our red sandstone slabs and place it here and here then go through well no here and here then these and it just gives the face a bit more feel and it also gives it a mouth so if we quickly go through very quickly like this refill these like so there's plenty of room here for an elevator which i am uploaded an elevator video a how to make an elevator video earlier today and um also in my recent video that i uploaded two days ago giving a tour of this base um it has an elevator in it and i designed this area so that the elevator fits perfectly in it so unfortunately that brings an end to the video but thank you very much for watching and if you liked it don't forget to subscribe or leave a comment down below if you want any of your redstone ideas or bases or even builds or whatever you want to be featured in my videos just drop a comment and I'll reply and hopefully feature it as this video was featured as Sean Adicott wanted me to build this. Thanks for watching.